the semifinals in top fuel. Only one driver in the semis. Corey McLennathan has won a race this season. We start with Doug Coletta and Antron Brown. And for Coletta, the last race that he won was the first race of the season in 2009. You can see he is already clinched into the countdown, and he faces Antron. Sean Langdon faces Corey McLennathan. Doug Coletta probably has the best opportunity he's had in quite a while to get a race win. This car coming off that number one qualifying position has been very consistent. He's had lane choice in both the first two rounds. He had the single in the first round by virtue of only 15 cars qualifying. But he went out there and laid down a nice 482, came back in the heat, and went a 488 to get lane choice over Antron Brown. My crew teams are really earning their money today. It's the fourth different racetrack they've seen this weekend. Really hot on Friday, a little cooler on Saturday. Of course, this morning's first round under the cloud cover and now kind of warming back up to what we've seen, but not quite as hot as yesterday. That bump out there in the left-hand lane now could start becoming a factor. shot right at the end though they both had trouble antron who swept the swing last year started that sweep at denver and doing so he beat doug coletta well give antron credit here obviously he had the, the advantage off the starting line 070 to an 096 about two and a half hundredths of a second it looked like uh, doug had the the race won he was much quicker to the eighth mile because yeah, because Antron started spinning the tires just a little bit easier, but Antron got his to recover a little bit better. As you take a look at Doug Coletta, 096 reaction time. Usually he's very good on the lights. May have been just off just a little bit on that particular run. And then right there, when his tires went up, they went up hard. And uh, oh, and then you see him lose the belt before the finish, and that's probably what uh, cost him the race at that point. And allowed Antron Brown, even though he was spinning the tires, he was able to drive around because he was still under power. Yeah, look at that right at the finish line. Dave Reef. Brian Karate, I mentioned before you run it to the fourth different track we've seen this weekend. How tough is it on you guys trying to figure out how to make these cars run? Oh, it's been trying, real trying on the top end of this race course for us. Uh, you know, but we're not going to quit. Maybe next round we'll get it right. One step closer to that first win. What would it mean to this team? Oh, that would be awesome. That means we're, we're on track the same as last year. You know? Yeah, it seems to me you swept that swing, eh? Yeah, that's true. <laughs> Good luck to you in the final. And our Motel 6, who got the light? Again, it's defined by Antron Brown's win. Came off the line, needed it. Good race, Doug. Thanks a lot, Dave. 